What is happening, my LinkedIn family? Welcome to Phenomenal Friday. I'm super stoked to be able to be with you, just to be able to share some things in all my heart. I kind of want to wrap up the week, right? I've, I've shared some content, had some incredible engagement, still am. I'm just excited about that. That's one of the reasons for today's Phenomenal Friday and to share with you uh, what really, really excites me. You. I'm freaking serious on Phenomenal Friday. It's you. I'm telling you what, there's no other reason on the planet for me to be here except you. I completely understand my call and my mission now. Now, I've got all kinds of phrases and things I could share with you, marketing stuff, but I just want to be real with you for a minute, right? I want you to understand that when I say friend and when I say committed and when I say you, I mean it, right? So here's the thing I want you to think about on Phenomenal Friday. I want you to check your heart. It's time for a checkup from the neck up and it's time for a checkup then the hallowed heart below, okay? Because here's what's important. What's important is the main thing. What do I mean by that? All right, so I was a pastor for over 30 years and counselor and coach and uh, I've been a business leader, entrepreneur, um, marketing, branding, designing. I'm a singer, songwriter, had a singing deal for quite a while, right? I mean, traveled all over the place. I mean, that in five bucks, give me a cup of coffee at Starbucks. Maybe, depends if it's a super skinny latte mate, whatever, I forget what it's called. But anyway, one of those things, right? Well, for those folks that are watching right now that have been in, in ministry, pastors, those that still are, uh, you might understand this. It's super easy while you're doing the ministry, while you're working for God, doing so many things. I'm talking about you've got phenomenal stuff. The ministry's great. People's lives are being transformed. You're doing stuff that is shaping and changing the world around you. A rock star for Jesus, right? problem is in the background it ends up that you do in ministry and you forgot about the main thing yeah your life might suck on the inside people don't know it coaching same thing it may be while you're a coach that it gets into the point that you're looking for the high ticket item right you're looking how to do your branding marketing get out there getting people to notice who you are because you need to get a high ticket client mm -hmm. in business world one thing i know is in sales numbers count what do i mean by that the more people you contact the more people you're going to be able to reach and the more people you reach the more sales you get and then what do you do you land a client somebody that can become a new number to you you'll be able to say i met my numbers right so there are so many things no matter what you do in your business if you're a business owner a ceo entrepreneur coach uh, counselor a pastor whatever you may be here on this platform it's so super simple to lose focus not focus of your mission and your business but lose focus of who you're trying to reach people aren't things they're not just numbers and clients if you want to be a friend with somebody and connect connect Take time to know who they are, right? Some people do that. This is not to bash everybody, obviously. This is one of those checkups for a phenomenal Friday. And I just hope that you would understand that through legacy and vision, things I've been talking about this week, that you have the golden opportunity to re-examine your heart and make that move today. I think today, this day, is a phenomenal Friday for you. And I'm telling you what, today's a day where you can flip out, my friends. Yeah.